Dear ones, we are the Arcturians. It is time now to recover from your ailments of the last thousands of years, beloved Earth humans. We are observing with joy that many of you started to understand the signs of this time and woke up, especially to the service they originally have incarnated for at this time on Earth. Many of you are now suddenly recognizing and understanding what the deeper meaning of your presence on Gaia is, and this is mostly a surprise but carries also a lot of satisfaction. Naturally, your soul and heart are now finally able to fully participate in life, which has been for many of you very difficult because you could not find any real meaning in your lives, other than purify yourselves to come to a spiritual understanding of existence and of your own nature. Now to understand, that this process was the very meaning of your life because it was needed to purify the deep densities of earth, which you helped with the purification and spiritualizing process of your own body minds, is extremely liberating for you and you experience to be profoundly energized. Therefore this time now has in some sense become a celebration for you, although the situation on earth has not yet officially recovered to love and peace which is the original characteristic of humanity. When we made the first time contact with some of you, many years ago in the 70s, our contact days were still living in an environment with people who were utterly unaware of other galactic civilizations and planets who, as a whole, lived in practice together in their society's spiritual life. They knew that the divine source energy is love and that all existence is originating from it. Now, only after 40 years on your planet, this situation has changed profoundly. The more and more people on Earth are aware of this truth and spreading it among others. Your planet Earth is even now on a point in your history where she will go through a transformation of a greatness and uniqueness that never before happened. Many more of you started to communicate with us, some of them can see us. Many of you are in telepathic contact with us and more and more can feel the high vibration of our light bodies. This is magnificent and such quickening of your evolutionary process is astounding and without comparison. Dear Earth humans, and now you have arrived at a point in your history where you will make the greatest leap you ever have encountered. Of course, it is not new for you that on 11.11.11 .11 massive new energies will be activated which can catapult you into higher dimensions. But for this to happen, you must be able to be in a disposition of an energetic expectancy. Your heart must be able to reach out and anticipate this great flux of new energy and light to flow into your own energetic system. When this happens, you will be able to jump in your consciousness and understanding into a completely new dimension of experience. You might have visited these places where you are going now to arrive before, but it makes a difference whether you visit it only or whether you arrive at a place for good, dear ones. When you arrive for good, this can mean many things, depending on your soul contract, but also depending on your level of preparedness. It might be that, once arrived, you will not return to the three-dimensional world and that you will just drop your physical body. Only in the case that your frequency is of the highest light, a physical body of your nature can be dissolved directly into light. But this will be very rare as this requires that you have already accomplished a very high spiritual realization. So most of you who are able to maintain their place in the higher dimensions, will be able, through their newly awakened multidimensionality, to stay with their physical body simultaneously in the third dimension, whereby their bodies will be transformed and assume a crystalline structure. This can happen very quickly but could perhaps be physically difficult for some, because of the adaptation of their body to their new frequency and at the same time, the high tend sensitivity to the lower vibration of the third dimension. However, as this process also implies that their new crystalline bodies can take on and hold significantly more light, that they do not have to suffer, as they did before in their old carbon-based body, in the midst of lower and denser energies. Bottom line is, that none of you has experienced this unique transformation and there will be people who do not experience any problems and who will have a very easy transition into their new body and frequency system, while others, depending on their history of perception and experience, might have struggle in the beginning. But this will not last for long, for all the adaptation will be successful in a short time. Those who do not arrive for good in the higher dimensions, might experience them perhaps relatively shortly, and then, as they are not prepared, to stay there, come back, holding this new experience in their memory. But some of them will be able to visit these new and higher dimensional places more and more often, 
until they adapt it to it in consciousness and in their energy system, so that they can stay there permanently. In some cases they will drop their body too, or live from then on multidimensionally, depending where their service is. The experience of this whole process has many different varieties, as each human being is unique, but there will be of course people with similar or identical experiences. They will find each other and join in groups together, as their soul level and spiritual experience is similar and these groups belong to soul families. Drawn to each other as a soul family, they will do their service to help humanity to ascend in due course of the year 2012 and thereafter. Dear ones, you are now at the threshold of your great adventure in your history, where there is no return to your old way of life. From now you will jump in big leaps along your ascension path and you will leave behind your life of difficulties and suffering, as Mother Earth and her new energies will carry and transport you to new and never before experienced chores where all your heart desires are fulfilled. We know that most of you who came to Mother Earth for service were never able during their incarnation in these times to just rest into, enjoy life as many other of their human fellows did and even live for, because you always felt a huge weight on your shoulders, knowing you had to do something important but mostly not knowing what it was. Now you can understand, but you will also start to experience, perhaps for many the very first time, the true joy of undisturbed mere being, as you have arrived at your destination, and as this will be, in your new experience, the means to assist your human family to ascend in the coming months and perhaps years. There is no exact and accurate time frame we can tell, because there are many unknown factors, as each human being follows their own unique process and learning curve. But we can tell that the great shift is already on its way, in a mighty and powerful way. And ultimately, it will never end, because all is always on their path of evolution and expansion in the heart of God. Be well and be blessed, dear ones. We are your family in the consciousness of the Cosmic Christ. We are the Arcturians.